Hi, I'm Melinda Gonzalez. I'm the coordinator for the Puerto Rican Heritage Cultural Ambassador Program for the Center for Puerto Rican Studies at Hunter College, CUNY. The motto for the Puerto Rican Heritage Cultural Ambassadors Program is to educate and to celebrate. We want to share central resources so that people are informed on topics important to the Puerto Rican community and are able to put these topics into a historical context. So a cultural ambassador learns about, teaches, celebrates, and shares Puerto Rican histories, stories, and culture. Currently, there are four free online modules that make up the materials for the Cultural Ambassadors Program. Course one, History of Puerto Ricans in the US. Part one, Pioneers, Pioneros is made up of four documentaries. One, on New York City's first Puerto Rican librarian, Pura Bel Pre. Another, on the founder of Centro, Frank Bonilla. Activist and poet, Clemente Soto Vélez and one of the founders of the New Yorkian poetry movement, Jesus Tato Laviera. Part two consists of seven essays by Dr. Virginia Sanchez Corol. It gives a comprehensive overview of the Puerto Rican experience in the United States. We've paired these readings with a number of other central materials, including maps, a timeline, and the Puerto Rican heritage poster series. Five posters that present major events themes and concepts chronologically and visually. Course two, Culture and Traditions, is made up of 10 short bilingual films. They feature contributions that Puerto Ricans have made throughout the United States. Course three, Socioeconomic Conditions, uses central data reports to share information on current realities on the island and stateside communities regarding citizenship, the economic crisis on the island, and the impact of Hurricane Maria. Course four, History of Puerto Rico, is made up of 15 short videos that begin with the Tainos and spans all the way to current events. The videos are created and narrated by Dr. Teresita Levy of Lehman College. All materials have teaching guides and quizzes. The Puerto Rican Heritage Cultural Ambassadors Program was founded in 2016 in collaboration with the National Puerto Rican Day Parade, Aspira, El Puente, and Comité Noviembre. In 2017, Centro began a partnership with the National Puerto Rican Day Parade to offer a day-long cultural ambassadors boot camp for their college scholarship recipients. Students participated in workshops and hands-on activities that led to many becoming certified cultural ambassadors. Libraries, such as the Cleveland Public Library, and Brooklyn Public Library have sponsored cultural ambassadors workshops and events. Cultural ambassadors materials has also been used during Women's History Month, Black History Month, and during month long activities for Comité Noviembre. Cultural ambassador junior resources are educational and instructional materials for teachers, librarians, parents, and caregivers of children from pre-K to fifth grade to teach and celebrate Puerto Rican history and culture using bilingual picture books written by Puerto Rican authors. Materials for Cucarachita Martina's musical adventure are included in this section. We invite you all to become cultural ambassadors. Help us in this important work of sharing and celebrating Puerto Rican histories, stories, and culture. To register, go to centropr.hunter.cuny.edu. And now, Please enjoy a short trailer for the Centro produced documentary, Pura Bel Pre, Storyteller, part of our Cultural Ambassadors Resources. The first story that I heard from my grandmother's lips, Teresa Martina has been my golden key in opening doors for me everywhere. It is just a fundamentally unique experience to read about characters that you can identify with. <laughs> <laughs> Every child deserves to be able to see his family, his community, himself, herself validated. At the same time, they all need windows. They need to know about other worlds. If you just read what she published, you would only have a fraction of a very skewed view 
of what she was writing. Um, but thank goodness we have her archives here.